Okay, so there's the kind of swank Santa boots. And the pretty swank gloves. What about the amulets? Amulets, hit or miss. Mostly miss. Okay. All hope is gone. Ghost boss. Oh, healed off the ghost boss. Sweet. Now let's get down to these. Defense, crit, attack speed. Hmm. Eh. What's this one? That's a little bit. Kind of worth? Kind of sort of? Kind of, maybe kind of sort of. I do wish some of the gear actually had special effects, but at the same time, though, it kind of make the whole loot treadmill situation worse. I was holding my own for a moment. Okay. Nah. That's better. Some of these are a little bit more debatable than others. A lot of HP on that one, but not much else. No. All right, and stat points. The one blessing to all of this is, uh, we do level slower, so I don't have to, so I don't have to manage as much between these, these fights. He's a bit tough. But then again, we are getting, uh, better equipment. Didn't I have, like, 10,000 defense? Uh, before I retired, like, at the start of today? I think I did. I was a tanky sucker. Alright, maybe let's go back to this one. For a bit. Because we can just dump all this. Until we get... Yes on that sword. What about the gloves? Yeah, yeah. What about the... Armor. Yeah, it'll hurt my damage a bit, but it gives me a bunch of defense. What about shields? Nope. Okay. Defense 29. Come back, you creature. Nope. Killed me in a moment. Oh, we're 103. I think I'm gonna stop here. We've We've hit a hard progress wall. Okay. So it looks like 500 speed. I mean, it barely looks. This is very much like, uh... Everything is just pure jitterbug. But it's gonna make the fights go real quick. It's gonna make it kind of hard to diagnose, like, when I... When and how I died. But I think I'm fine with that. Okay, so stats are looking real good for the beginning of this. And slimes! It's barely watchable. Meh. Gear, gear differences? Oh. Guess I should probably level these up. It's kind of those initial skills that actually make a massive difference. Oh, we do have an orc child. Okay, let's actually look at orc child that isn't... ridiculously... Well, yeah, it's an orc child. Honestly, that orc child looks a lot more competent and possibly older than, uh, you know, I'm actually a little bit disappointed. It'd be really cool if, um, every generation you actually got to pick, like, the, uh, the coupling or something. There's a little bit of, like, uh, random generation on who you were paired with as, like, a retire, uh, a retirement bonus. You know, it's like, well, do you want the orc traits? More damage! Or the ghost traits, where you just have, like, avoidance perks. Okay. There we go. I'm already level 11. That's nuts. Low! I can even kill that guy now. Oh, that makes this so much easier. And yeah, I'm not gonna care too hard about gear or equipment. Like, I'll kind of try, but it, it doesn't matter. 
Stop this crazy thing. Never. There is no getting off the beard man train. I think my beard is actually pure white. I was not exactly paying pure... Uh, I was not paying a whole lot of attention to it. To be frank. Zoom. Does shift clicking work for item slots? Interesting question. Nope. You're quoting space balls. I know. I was just taking a little bit. Literally. I haven't seen Spaceballs in years. I should go back and watch it at some point. It's a good movie. Mad Cloud's Little Home. More like Mad... Mad Cloud's Little Killing Grounds. Let's see. Right. Should probably update equipment as we go by. Is kind of important. Okay, look at all those stat points. Look at all that speed. Look at all that beard. We're good. Vroom. I was always a little disappointed that, uh... That we never got, like, Spaceballs 3. I would have loved Spaceballs 3 to be a movie that wasn't even a Spaceballs movie. It was like a documentary on, on uh... Effectively... Uh, maybe not Rick Moranis' life, but, like, people trying to convince Rick Moranis to return to acting. And also them trying to convince, you know, modern Hollywood executives for the, uh... Uh, to actually fund the movie. I would watch that in a heartbeat. It'd probably actually be real boring, maybe? I mean, it could be done really well. I don't, I don't know. I really wish I could shift click for this. It would be so much easier. Yeah, every time <laughs> every time we go through one of these, I just gained like stupid amount of stat points. Woo. <laughs> oh, this is this is great. This is why I like uh the occasional game like this where you can like overgrind and just become like an a, unbeatable horror monster. You know what we could do is actually just take things like three levels at a time. Okay. Uh, until we hit the wall. Then we put on then we put on new gear and figure out what I actually need to progress. Let's see. And yeah, I'm not going to be weighing too many of the bonuses and uh, pluses and minuses here. I'll weigh some of them, but uh, I'm not, I'm not going to be staring at a stat screen forever. Useless garbage. Uh, let's just do that now. I want to say my stats are scaling faster at this point, but I think it's just because I'm level 56 in, uh, the Buccaneer level. The ocean? <laughs> yep, there it goes. Speed bump. Alright. Oh, there's our new gear. Yeah, so what I'll probably do is just, uh, go until I, I kind of can't. And then we'll stop manage gear. I remember when those, uh, skeleton archers, I think it was on the Road of Dreams, would stop me. Oh, and there they go. Well, then again, I did kind of figure. I don't know if they're going to stop me after this, though. That's a bit of a tall order. I, I think I'd... I wouldn't say I just doubled my attack power, but I, it was a considerable increase. Okay. Hello! No, they got me. Oh, these have 600, 700. Okay, pay attention to the equipment you're getting. This stuff is so crash! Except for the gloves. I think I think these gloves are, are better. Yeah. Okay, so no more 
crit rating. Or I could just continue doing it because even that, like, small amount of crit rating actually helps quite a lot. Okay, there we go. And they're going down. Yeah, let's just go, let's just go full all-rounder. It'll make it easier on me. Demons. Demons are killing me. But yeah, we're, we're rolling pretty, pretty outdated gear. Outdated feeling gear? That's a boost. Because, yeah, I remember when we got the uh, the fusion rewards and it would be like, yeah, I, I'm like ten times stronger now. We don't really get that. But we get some other stuff. I guess let's just do Road to Dreams like several times. Probably until my inventory fills up. Miss the absurd increases of Clicker Hero. I do and I don't. I miss it, but it was it it got to the point where it, like it really straight up felt like nothing mattered anymore. Admittedly, we've hit that point in this game as well, where it's it's like it matters, but it's every upgrade is so so minuscule in the grand scheme of things that it doesn't really make a difference. Okay, lightning. Where's my jittery mouse? I do not like it. Okay. I'm level 80. So yeah, this seems to be about kind of our, our standard wall. And we just blew right past it. See anything else? 99? No. Might as well go with the HP. Always go for the dual stats. They're not balanced that well. Also go attack speed. 50, 50 damage at this point is is meaningless. It's garbage. I skipped an HP upgrade. Oh, did I? So I did. Kind of, kind of easy to miss. Okay, the false savage. How will we do against boss man? Uh, toss up. We got it. Okay, anything else? Yeah, that's better. These banana sword swords have range on their damage. But maybe it's because I'm still in the territory where it matters. Okay, crit. It wouldn't actually be a uh, worthy upgrade if I had been paying attention, but I haven't been paying attention. Well, should we, uh, should we switch games soon? Because I'm, I'm enjoying this. But I wouldn't mind switching over to, like, uh, a dark room for a little while or something. Because, uh, Lightning Retirement ser Simulator is ridiculous. <laughs> Santa's gone pumpkin mode. He has. He really has. Okay. Keep going with this. It's a blast. Okay. <laughs> that was so fast. I mean, we are going on, like, ludicrous speed here. But we pretty much walked into Nefcock's graveyard and died. Well, fitting place to die. More garbage. Garbage that I don't need. Uh, ha -ba 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 -ba. let's get the self revival. It's probably the most helpful. I do want to make some progress at some point, but we're gonna have to just keep retiring at least for a little while longer. Okay. So what do you? None of these are none of, none of these are particularly amazing. Okay, I haven't missed anything. Come on, Nefcock! Bow before me. There we go. I wonder. So, if I remember right, this game is not made by native English speakers. I wonder what uh, the translations on some of these were originally, before they uh. 
Well, it became stuff like Nefcock. HP and crit. No, no, that's a lot more crit. Yeah, those amulets are like the one few, one of the few upgrades that remains good. Okay, that's some more, that's some more progress. Yeah, I'm just going for the biggest blue I can possibly ram. Generally, uh, crit rating is like the one thing I'll stop for and switch over. Ooh, we have a decent amount of crit too. And I'm already level 99. Hot dang. Okay. Oh, right, those... Those gloves would have actually been kind of worthwhile. This is probably worthwhile. 10% crit might not have been a bad idea. Oh well. I mean, we'll get there. Look at all this trash. Okay, let's let's see if we can make progress. Cause like, we haven't actually tried to get very far. In this game, we usually get to about this point, and then it's like, well, we can retire. Maybe it's about time that we actually see what's see what's further. Maybe not. I don't know, let's see if we can beat this. The problem is we keep getting to the ghost boss. I guess I should probably slap on a new helmet. 5% crit for my stats. Pretty good. But you kind of lose your sense of scale going into a lot of these. Uh, yeah. Mm. You kind of lose your sense of scale just a little bit going into a lot of this because it's just there's there's like uh moving goalposts maybe it keeps moving back a little bit crit attack speed i don't think most of these are worthwhile okay, there's the santa boots but yeah we're actually finally at a point where the, even the santa boots aren't aren't an upgrade if i remember right they were a particularly sizable landmark no, keep the pumpkin. Nah. Nah, we can we can get the pumpkin back at a later date. Well, not that one, but any any pumpkins. We do not really need 60. Oh, one of those was actually better. We don't really need 60 attack speed. What about these? Let's attack. X speed crit, nah. Oh, 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 we got him. We got the ghosty man. All right, there's some upgrades. 8% attack upgrade. The amount you scale after you start defeating a couple of these, like, more uh, edge edge case bosses. Yeah, let's, let's see if we can actually take this guy somewhere. The day. Okay, so we can go after Heavy Lies of the Crown, but let's actually head over to the Twilight Battlefield. I should probably slow this down a little bit. We have it on 500 speed, but we really don't need 500 speed. Let's let's do five five times speed. Sleeping Hero. Okay, we want to slow that down even further. No, we don't. We don't want to do that. Sleeping Hero. Okay, so he has got 7 million HP. Is this... So this is a considerable wall, but this isn't the end, is it? I mean, he does a gross amount of damage. But, like, there's this whole area afterwards. Unless we get there through... 
down here. Because I'm assuming sleeping, sleeping hero is... We're not going to be able to uh, clear him. There, there's another. There's got to be another boss after that. You know, an auto trash anything that isn't an upgrade, but button would be kind of nice. I'd like that. Okay, there is more. Good. I was like, wait, have I really hit the end of content? Because that'd be... That'd be distressing. Okay. We'll put it up to 500. We might as well just turbo die on this section a bunch. Gonna be tough getting past this part-ish. None of these are good. Okay, I guess we could go back to All Hope is Gone. But remember, right, this is like a gross amount of equipment, though. Some of it's really freaking good, though. Okay. Go back to the stats. Do it one more time. Yeah, if you want to... If you want to farm the uh the bonus the fusion chest this is the place to do it okay so we get the we get the super socks what we need is a better pair of gloves probably we might be able to beat the next boss like this uh no i want that defense these these guys hit like trucks Oh. Okay, super gloves. They're good gloves. I'll grab them. What about that? No. Not thoroughly convinced. Otherwise, we could start over again. The main problem is I, I think I just don't have enough attack and defense. Hmm... Uh, uh, we want that. This has slightly less, but has an attack multiplier on it. So this one might actually be better. Nope. This is just straight up better. I guess the multiplier is meaningless if you don't have a good base. More attack, slightly less HP, and a Hmm. Or we could just do this one. Less defense, more attack. I guess we'll go with that for the time being. I'm just going to keep rolling down this one. These guys drop new stuff. Oh, we actually got... We did, we did well there. Hmm. I'm mildly stuck for a moment. Nothing. We need to replace this amulet now that I'm looking at it. It's bad. We're not getting a whole lot of amulets from this, though. Seven percent attack, more HP. Get me some crit. No. Okay. Uh. We'll take that at a bit of a loss. And go for the crit crit rating. Maybe crits will be the secret to success here. Ugh. Nothing. Ooh. Defense ain't great. Crit bonus is nice. Hex speed 14. Defense and crit. Okay, there we go. 
I wonder if at some point it gets to the point where uh, you don't have enough raw, like, raw base defense because you're getting too many of those percentage bonuses. Probably never really gets there. Uh, let's see. This one. Slightly better, but no. What about the helmet? No. Still no amulets. They're shockingly rare. We'll just go back and do this one. Maybe I'll get a little bit... Some more. Okay, and we get a slightly better... Attack damage wise, yeah, yeah, that's a that's an absolutely better upgrade to what I'm rolling with. This one. Is this a little bit of defense, a little bit of HP? Yeah. A lot of crit rating. I think I've seen better from that setup. And yeah, there's also this one that's just a bunch of HP. Not terribly interested. Okay, and I'm up to 105. So close. Well, I'm getting closer. Yeah, it's just one heck of a wall that we're staring down right now. Oh! No, we're getting substantially closer. Because, yeah, once we can get him on farm, this gets easier. Oh, right. This horror monster. Defense 4%, HP, just a raw attack. Yeah, that works. I think that might have actually just been the edge we needed. Yep, there it goes. All right. Beautiful. All right, so we've, get, we've got better gloves. Not sold on this necklace. Sword. Sold on the helmet, though. Once we get, once we get like a, a full complement of well, once we get my defense like double, that'll make a massive difference. That weapon actually scares me. It makes me uncomfortable. Yes, I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Uh, attack ten percent. Yes, that's a damn good thing. Damn good things. Okay, and that was that was my that was my metal sock. Okay, so yeah, I think we're just gonna farm this guy for a bit. Cause he seems to have the goodies. We want to get a better version of the demonic monstero's sword. Cause that's what we had earlier and it was pretty good. Okay, so I get some stat points. Barely any. Honestly, at this point, I'm just going to start alternating HP and defense. We do damage, but the enemies the enemies still hit hard. Okay, that's better. I do appreciate that the fusion is still like a, a good source of stat points. After a certain point. Okay. Yeah, that's that's a thousand defense. That's a ton. I died. Uh-oh. No, I've gone up and I've gone up in everything. I'm not actually sure what's killing me here. Grab that. Okay, that's that's a big tick up. Oh, I gave up like twenty thousand HP. Really? That yeah, that would do it. I wasn't paying enough attention, I guess. Problem is, I, I traded a bunch of HP for defense here. Hmm. Well, let's keep going for a bit. I don't foresee myself beating the hero as I currently am. If I can't beat this guy uh, without breaking a sweat, we're just going to get clobber knotted.
Okay, we got him this time. Uh, it's still all kind of bupkis. At least the EXP that we get from these fights is, is not... It's not bad. Okay, we get this, though. Bunch of defense, bunch of HP. Okay, not a bunch of defense, but still. Gets my gets my HP up a bunch. Good 4,000. Yeah, I'm just going to keep investing in it. Let's see, defense doesn't seem to do that much. I still need defense real bad. Like, it doesn't do that much, unfortunately, but... Uh... I think we just need to invest more points into, uh, def well, both, really. That helmet. Oh, yeah. No, we are, we are murder claws full, full on at this point. Problem. That's nah, not, that's no good. I think the rest of this is, yeah, it's garbage. So at this point, we should probably just retire. Let's just try and take on the, uh, let's try and take on the sleeping hero. Oh, we got him. Okay, we got path cleared. Okay, defense 1%, it's a lot of HP, and a lot of attack. Go back on stats. Attack HP, attack HP. We lose some crit there. Defense, attack, attack, speed. Yeah. 